really ought to spend a few more minutes. You want to see sex drive? Excuse me, guys. Who brought him? Who brought it? She brought him. I brought it. Didn't you just say it? She brought him right there. I did. Let's have. They're little. Ooh. She's got nice boobies, though. Yeah, but she got second place in a wet t shirt contest. When? I said that as a joke, and I hope he knew I was joking. No, he Because I got first place. Whoever it was, he had no idea. <laughs> bed with. These are the guys responsible for making sex drive. They will also be responsible for my first menage a trois. <laughs> Your first. <laughs> hey. Sean and I haven't had a three-way since like that hooker in Kansas City. <laughs> okay, you guys, where the fuck did this movie come from? Where the fuck? Uh, well, it fucking started with a fucking book. Yeah, huh? And, uh, and then this fucking producer fucking called us. <laughs> yeah. And we read the fucking book. We read the fuck out of this fucking book. Like, I bet you did. We read from page fucking one to page fucking whatever ended that bitch. And, uh... <laughs> We took just a little seed of what the book was, which is a kid meets he a girl said he online. I just took a seed. He I took that. a yeah. seed. <laughs> Sounded <laughs> gay, but it wasn't. I swear. <laughs> I've been taking his seed all night. Woo! Oh, Ow! <laughs> we sort of cover a lot of things in this film. A lot of dirt gets covered in this film. We have glory holes. We have internet porn. What were your fun parts? This is probably the funnest part of the entire film, I'd say. <laughs> By far. Yeah, most of the This time film we was were... hard to make. It was like a real job. This is the reason why. This is yeah. why we you make, make movies. movies? This is it right here, Hollywood. <laughs> <laughs> that and the scat films they do on the side. <laughs> <laughs> now, where would you put this film on the boner scale? How does it rate? Uh, does it count that I'm three quarters erect right now? <laughs> it always counts. <laughs> there it Cheers. is. Cheers. <laughs> These are my new favorite filmmakers of all time, <laughs> right here in my bed. And I, thank you for making this film, by the way. Oh. Right. I think there will be a lot of people out there in TV land that are very happy that this is now in existence. Are people, like, watching this with their pants off, or...? It's... <laughs> <laughs> no good television is the most fun please, you'll ever if, have with your pants off. If you on. are <laughs> masturbating, please just watch this area over here. Wait, I can Not fix so that. Not so much us over here. Okay, there you go. Wow. Keep focus on that part. <laughs> oh, and we need the cocoa butter if anybody has any. I'm Send from some Wisconsin. In. I don't even know what to do with this. When you guys were shooting, were you ever confused with a porn shoot? Yeah, in Florida we had to uh, we had to go uh, under the title Untitled Teen Road Movie because we couldn't get uh, we anytime we'd get a location we'd lose it because they would find out it was for sex drive and they figured that couldn't be a good thing. And then the Amish community started to rebel. No, the Amish community was down with the project from day one. Of course one. they were. From Springer! Springer. Who knew that the Amish people were good at fixing cars, good Which, at blowjobs, and Which, cards. By the way they are. And butt fucking. I'm thinking of converting to Amishism. Yeah, you should. <laughs> you should do that. that. I'd like word? to see that in action. <laughs> you would look good churning some butter. I, I think my biggest holy shit moment was the first time I saw James Marsden perform as Rex because we really didn't know what he was going to do with that part. Because you're a homo! It was a big holy shit moment seeing James Marsden play Rex. Mine was, so, was seeing a 75 year old man's balls. Real uh, balls. Oh, those were not his real balls. Yes. That's, that's a day in the life for those me. Those were his real balls? Yeah. How do you cast someone as the old dude with the balls hanging out? I can tell you. Balls. I can actually tell you how. It's actually a Swear funny Please story. Please tell me. The guy in the movie was the guy who actually made the fake prosthetic balls. He was from our art department. In the middle of the audition, he said he was Cuban, and he said, you know, my, uh, my real balls are very large. And he just threw his real balls out. And I, they were. It was like that, that, <laughs> that thing in Boogie Nights when he said, uh, may I see it? And, uh, and I was just like, may I see them? And he said, yeah, sure. And he just threw them out there. And we said, you have the part. And, uh, yeah. So what can you tell me about this motherfucker oh, while he's on uh, the phone? Hey, can I just call you back yeah. in a few minutes? Um, he's about okay, I'll call eight, you back nine in inches, fully erect. <laughs> that was, you know what? Cut that was for real? That was the limo driver. 
I'm, and and I'm, I'm not making that we up. So you're kind of a big it deal sounds, now? It sounds really cool. That's why I said it out loud. That you were just trying to driver. impress me? Uh, well, I was no, already I wasn't, impressed. That's what I'm saying. It really was the limo driver. Which or What we're saying is we got a limo parked only, outside. That's the only so time I've ever really gotten a call putting it out there. <laughs> you're kind of a rock star. There's a, ta- there's, there's a town car He's going to be big. <laughs> Might want to, you know, get in on the ground floor of our dicks. <laughs> I think for what year is it? For oh, for oh nine. Mm. I'm just gonna just make a prediction. I'm gonna say Bush is back. I'm oh, let's say, hope not. Not, not politically. Damn, let's I'm hope say, not. <laughs> I'm gonna say that you know now it's kind of like you know every girl out there look you know kind of looks like like a 12 year old down there, and I think it's I think it's time to bring. We're back. bringing 70s Bush back. <laughs> yeah. Oh wait, do you think Rumspringa was all full of 70s Bush? I would think so. I would think so too. Everything's cyclical. It all comes back around. Do Amish yeah. girls wax? It's like bell bottoms. Would like that even make Bush sense? is gonna return like like the way bell bottoms. Look at this. I've got. Hey, if I stop shaving my crotch, can I stop shaving all together? No. No. Let's get serious. For a <laughs> Sorry, ladies. I was trying to help you out. I got completely shut down. <laughs> yeah. Who watches this show? <laughs> you will. Uh, I will. Your mama. With, with my pants down. <laughs> for real. Hi, cocksuckers. <laughs> Fuck you and come see our motherfucking movie film. Asshole, dick, suckers. <laughs> fucking, uh, yeah, so, uh, uh, there's this fucking movie, you know? Uh, fucking called fucking Sex Drive. So, uh, fucking, I don't know, like, I think I'm gonna go and, like, maybe call my fucking friends. Fucking, you should go see this fucking movie, you know? Christ. Okay, so... So fucking sex drive in yeah. theaters, like, right now. Seriously, if this thing doesn't work out, you know, yeah. we're always looking for, you know, actresses. Assistants. Yeah, assistants. <laughs> if you want to be our ass. People who want to work with... You guys, us. just wait. I'm going to be a big deal. Work with us. <laughs> I mean, work with, with us. <laughs> just putting it out there. Are you familiar you with them? the pepper grinder? As a matter of fact, here. Hold that. <laughs> Mine makes noise. <laughs> You're that you, guy. Don't, you, don't, you don't even have parents, do you? I, no, they disowned me a long time ago. <laughs> Where have you been all my life? Who's your daddy? Is this coming out of my cut of the movie? Is this really 60 minutes? Because... <laughs> Someone lied to you! <laughs> I think I've been duped. I think it's a Christian Science Monitor, wasn't it? <laughs> yes. It's no good!